the problem might be related to some malfunctioning programs or services or corrupted system files. First let's turn off Superfetch service. Click on Windows button, type in Services and press Enter. In newly opened window, in the list, locate Superfetch process, right click on it and select Stop. Now let's use built-in system scanners to scan system files. Right click on Windows button, select Command Prompt Admin. In Command Prompt Environment enter displayed commands one by one, each followed by Enter click. Now let's run Windows Update Troubleshooter. Click on Windows button, then click on Settings button. In newly opened window click on Update and Security option, then in the menu on the left, click on Troubleshoot. Once there, click on Windows Update option and choose to run the troubleshooter. When the scan is over, check if the error still persists. For this method let's modify processor scheduling options. Click on Windows button, type in Control Panel and hit Enter. In newly opened window click on System, then in the menu on the left click on Advanced System Options. In the Appeared System Properties window, click on the Settings button under Performance section. When in the Performance Options, go to Advanced tab and under Processor Scheduling select Programs option. Click Apply, then OK to save the changes. Now let's check the issue in the Clean Boot. Click on Windows button, type in System Configuration and hit Enter. In Newly Opened Window, in General tab, select Selective Startup option and uncheck Load Startup Items box. Then go to Services tab, check the box at the bottom of the window to hide all Microsoft services and click Disable All button. Click Apply, then OK and restart your PC. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more videos.